Hey guys, today is Friday, June 9th. It is my sixth day fishing for the Yak Tribe Tournament. We're getting down to the wire here. This is the final week of the tournament, so there's just a few days left. Right now, currently, I'm still in the lead, but I'm not going to sit on it. I'm going to keep pushing forward and keep trying to add to my score. So, uh, not the best time to be fishing in East Tennessee right now, at least for big catfish. Water temps are 72 degrees. We got a full moon tonight. Most likely these big catfish are going to be spawning and they're going to be impossible to catch, but you just never know. Uh, about three years ago, similar conditions, similar circumstances, I caught the biggest blue cat that I've ever caught in the kayak. So you know, as long as you got a bait in the water, you got a chance. So uh, we're going to get started out here tonight. It's about 8.30 right now. We're going to be fishing the night shift. Uh, so I just got some fresh bait. I'm going to go get anchored down. We'll get started. Yeah, there we go. Oh, that's a good fish. That's a good fish. Here I was, worried about getting skunked out here tonight on this full moon. Been out anchored down 20 minutes or so and got the first fish on. We'll get a measurement on him here and see if he'll replace one of my others. Now that's where it gets interesting. Because in order to have my light, for you all to be able to see me while I'm filming, I had to put on my other rod holder, which this board will not fit. <laughs> that's a problem. Here's what we're going to have to do. I'm going to have to move this rod back here. Take that rod holder off. Now we're in business. Yeah, guys, looky there. That's a good fish. That'll replace one of my others. All right, guys. Looky there. He's skinny, but he'll go 35 inches. You know, I was worried about these fish like this size right here and bigger being on the spawn tonight, but uh, I don't know, as skinny as this guy is, he may have already spawned, so we'll take him. That's another fish cold for the tournament. Back you go, pal. Let's see if he's on there. Yep, he's on. Fish on. Pretty good sized dink. He won't replace any of my other fish, but uh, <laughs> still fine anyway. Let's let him go. Go get big for me. Oh. This fish here hit a live bluegill. Guys. Look here, that's been a pretty good fish. I'm gonna measure him here just to see if he will replace any of my others. He, no, he's about 30. He might go 31, so the next fish I need to replace is like 30 and a half, so I'm not gonna bother taking a picture of him. Still, that's a nice fish. Get him back in and get another one. There we go. Ooh, that's a good fish right there. It feels like can't get the rod out the rod holder. <laughs> I love it when that happens. <laughs> another decent fish right there. Alright, there we go. And he is all wrapped up in my other line. See if I can get this mess untangled here. Wow, well, he got the other line. Swim in the direction he was, but he got it. All right, guys, there you go. Another solid fish. That's a 32 and a half inch fish right there, so I had to replace one of my others. <laughs> it's turned into a pretty good night out here. Let's get him back. Little guy. 
just a little feller, but hey, he'll get big someday. And they all fun to catch. <laughs> Here we go again. I was about to doze off when that fish hit. <laughs> All right, there we go. He's not big enough to cull one of my other fish, but still worth waking up for. <laughs> Thank you, go, pal. All right, guys, it's 1 a.m. and I am tired, so I'm gonna call it quits for the night. Ended up having a good night out here, certainly far better than what I anticipated. Some dog going crazy over there. But uh, I don't know, uh, I didn't come out here with high expectations, but I ended up catching six blue cats. Two of them were big enough for me to cull a couple of my other previous submissions, so I was able to add to my score. Uh, I'm going to try to fish at least one more day before this tournament ends. Uh, you know, I've got a lead right now, but I'd like to pad it a little bit if I can, so I'm going to try to get one more day in. But uh, as for tonight, I am done. You can stick a fork in me. I'm going to go home and hit the sack. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you in the next video.